Hello, we're going to calculate the area and perimeter of compound shapes made with rectangles. To begin with question A, we're going to look at two different ways of doing this. We can work out the area of this rectangle, which is 5 cm by 2 cm, which would be 5 times 2, 10 cm squared. And this rectangle, which is 3 by 2, so 3 by 2 is 6. So in total, we have 16 centimeters squared. Another way to see this rectangle is not as two rectangles put together, but as the difference of two rectangles. So we have a bigger rectangle here with a base, again, of 5, but now a height of 4 centimeters. So the area of a big rectangle would be 4 cm times 5 cm, 20 cm squared. Take away the area of this square in the corner, which is 2 by 2, which is take away the 4 cm squared. So in total, 16 cm squared. You get the same answer both ways. For question B, I'll use a similar approach. We have two rectangles, rectangle A and rectangle B. Rectangle A can be found as two centimeters times four centimeters, which is eight centimeters squared. Rectangle B, which is two by three, which is six centimeters squared. So in total, add them together, we have 14 centimetres squared. Another way of doing question B could be as the difference of two rectangles. We could do 4 centimetres by 4 centimetres for the square, the bigger square. Take away the 2 centimetres squared here. So we have 16 centimetres squared. Take away the 2 centimetres squared Again, we have 14 centimeters squared. For question C, we will look at it as two rectangles again. The problem now is we know that this length is six and we know that this length is four, but we haven't been given this length. But we know that it must be two because the two add for four would make six. So this rectangle would be with two times two, four centimeters squared plus this rectangle, which is 6 by 4, 24 centimetres squared. So in total, 28 centimetres squared. Again, we can see it as the difference of two rectangles. So we have the biggest rectangle, which in this case is a square of 6 by 6. Take away the rectangle in the corner, which we know is 2 by 4, because this is 2 and this is 6, so this must be 4, which is 8 centimetres squared. So we have 36 centimetres squared minus the 8 centimetres squared, which again is 28 centimetres squared. Thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful and check out mrmathematics.com for the full lesson and worksheet.